Yeah, but in chatty it says Beardy Duck has been banned from talking for some reason. It's weird that it would say that in chatty. This is not the perfect attack run, it's just a perfect attack run. Wait, I'm sure there are more. I mean, not many more, but at least a couple more, right? But there must be better hack runs. Plus, I'm not actually hacking, I'm just being quick. We, lo we load two saves? Yeah, three saves. We load three saves. Yep, you're right. You've seen this game once and you already know more about it than me. Get out. Please. I can't have this competition in, in the room. But yeah, this is any percent, new game plus, no out of bounds. Um, I need to attack these guards because uh, attacking them and making them chase me is faster than watching them walk around and uh, listen to their dialogue lines. So I attack them once there so that I only need to attack them four times here. We're not out of this yet. And then they'll get really angry at me and try to kill me. I've seen you. But right now, this guy just wants to talk. Uh, we don't really like talking, so we're just gonna talk as fast as we can. We must keep moving. Better not close this one. There's no way to open it from the other side. Four. Um, I wish Renault wouldn't get in the way with that. That would be a pretty good mod. So they'll chase me down here, and uh, once they get to about this staircase, I want Renault standing right there. Yeah, she traders this part going on, so she was in a really good position there, actually. Now they're all dead. Alright. Come on, come on down here. Alright, so I'm going to do a save glitch here. This was found yesterday by Bubbles Del Fuego. What I'm going to do is I'm going to walk into the, a door at the same time as I load another character. And it will actually take that other character and transport it into um, this new position. And that's why this is New Game Plus. Because we're loading characters um, from save games that we didn't make um, during the same play session. I'm just going to run through here, and hopefully I'll get it. So I got it. Or at least I think I did. So you're going to see this pop up for a split second. So it's loading that character. And because it still has to load the door, it brings it in here. So this is a character that I made for this. Um, he's very fast because he has 8 Skuma stat on him. As well as some uh, items that make him a bit speedier. And I actually need uh, this guy to run me through a couple rooms here, but then in a bit, um, I need to swap him out for another character. So if I were to run this all the way through, um, it actually wouldn't work because uh, a certain door would be locked. So I need to switch the character right here to this guy. And um, this is a character I made who is just past this point in the game. And um, that's important because the or the door I need to go through has not locked yet. So you'll see fresh bodies here because I literally just killed these guys on the other uh, thing. And now I'm slow again, unfortunately, but that's okay. I should have used the speed boost a bit sooner, actually. So I lost a bit of time there. But now this door is open, which is really important. On the other file, it would have been locked and we would not have been able to continue. We're just going to attack this guy and bring him down to the bottom and then yield so that he uh, runs down here instead of walks down here. And uh, for some reason that guy spawns, so we're just going to kill that guy. I'm going to wait right here and as soon as he starts his dialogue right here, we just want to attack him again. So he'll attack us and he will run over here with us. And then we just want to yield. Oh, I don't want to talk to you. I just want to yield to you. Don't worry, buddy. 
don't see any good options here. I I also don't even I don't even split. I don't even know why I have splits. This one's too fast for splits. So we just need to wait for the Emperor to talk to us, and then kill the assassin when he comes out. I can go. That was a good kill. Alright. Now we need to wait for this guy to come in here, and as soon as he kneels, we can talk to him. Good monk, because we need the speed for the 10 seconds we're walking. And uh, now we're going to do another glitch up here. We're going to do the same save glitch. We're going to load that final file. And um, with, this, with the items, you actually load some other stuff. So one of the things I load here is a quest. Um, specifically all the quests. So this file has completed all the quests except for the last one. Um, which means when I come out here... All the quests will be completed, and I am on the final quest, which is to go talk to Okado. So right when I get out here, there's Okado, and Martin is here, and I just have to talk to these guys. Martin Septon. Chancellor Okado. Chancellor Okado. Cutting. Your no. And and now we just have to run to the end. Now we wait for Martin, and uh, it'll go down very suddenly like that when he spawns. Talk to him. Alright. And uh, when he turns around... I do. Time. There we go. And that's the game. That is Oblivion Any Percent New Game Plus No Out of Bounds. In 7 minutes and 33 seconds. With loads included. I don't know what the time is without loads. It would be a bit less. Sub 7.30 for sure. Alright, there we go. The amulet is shattered. Dagon.